Jake and wife Renee added baby Clara to the family last year. It capped off a great 2012 for the Ress family, and 2013 has started off on a positive note as well. Clara, she's been an absolute blessing, uh, unbelievable experience to have a little one, and uh, she's been awesome. You know, she really sleeps well, drinks well, smiles at us, and uh, just been amazing. I've really enjoyed the parenthood so, so far, and uh, it's just been a big blessing. Ruiz loves being a dad and is a very hands-on father. I'd say I'm a playful father. I like uh, picking her up and you know trying to get a smile out of her. It's great fun and I mean I really I suppose I'm a caring father as well. It's not nice to see her cry so you really just uh, try and uh, you know be there for her the whole time and try and do everything as well as possible. Ruiz won three times in 2012. The first of those coming in a playoff against good friend Chris Swanepoel for the Platinum Classic title at Moinoy. Jake had wife Renee on the bag for the last time. To cap it off with a win was special. Moino was, uh, was definitely an awesome event for us. We sort of said ahead of time it's going to be a last event at Caddies and then we won it and, uh, against Chris. You know, he's a very good friend of mine. We travelled together in America for, for many years and um, it made it really special. I, was, I wanted him to win as well but uh, it was really nice. So set up the year for, for, for good things, uh, absolutely. Having studied at Stellenbosch University, Ruiz felt at home in the Cape and enjoyed the inaugural Cape Town Open held at Royal Cape Golf Club. Like his win at Moinoy, Ruiz had a family member on the bag. This time, it was his dad. Cape Town Open were, was a bit bigger uh, in terms of it being a summer event and uh, a little bit of a stronger field, but uh, my dad caddied for me for the first time. Uh, you know, he's not a golfer, so it was sort of a unique experience, a really uh, different week because I was trying to just show him where, where he must stand, where he must stand and, and really try and guide him and I think maybe in a way that sort of took a bit of my concentration away from the pressure of the actual contention of the, of the week but um, I felt really calm the whole week and uh, stayed with my sister in Cape Town that week so it was a whole family affair and uh, just a great week to, to remember. Jake has an accounting degree to his name. But not one to sit idle, he has started a law degree and hopes to complete that and add it to his impressive resume. I studied uh, way back in the day uh, at Stellenbosch University, finished in 2001. So I don't remember much, but that was accounting and now uh, recently I started with law. So uh, that's a completely different uh, environment for me. But I, but I really enjoy it. It's, it's, everything's new and it's, uh, it's quite interesting. and. Uh, I like to watch all these uh, law programs on TV and I thought, you know, why not start, start studying some law as well. And then maybe in a second career, you know, I can, can look after some players, uh, contracts and, you know, what have you. And, and the nice thing about studying is also I got the student card, which gives me half price 10 in bowling on Wednesdays. So, so that's also a nice career. The studies, it's, it's, it's quite important, but I mean, it's it definitely plays second fiddle to the golf. You know, golf is my career. I'm just doing the studies as sort of a supplement. I wouldn't say a hobby, but it's something to give a bit of perspective on things sometimes and a little bit of balance, and then maybe down the line, I can still use it uh, in the second career at a later stage, and it definitely won't hurt me to have a law degree. Multitasking is clearly something Jake Ruiz is good at. Last year was an amazing year for, for me on and off the golf course. I mean, uh, the three wins, like I mentioned earlier, and uh, my wife giving birth to our little daughter, Clara. I'd love to, to get a foot in the door somewhere overseas. Um, I'm definitely working towards uh, European Q School. I've taken up membership of the European Tour, so I'm trying to get one or two starts during the year as well and uh, try and play in those and just try and move up that money list and maybe get some status already for next year, else I'll go to Q School and try and get a card over there. Um, but in South Africa, in the meanwhile, I'd like to be in contention as, as many times as possible. You know, that's a goal, to try and be there on the last nine holes, uh, have a chance to win. I think that's, that's huge. If I can put myself there you know, five or six times for the year, I really feel like I've, I've done well. With six Sunshine Tour victories to his name and his wonderful family life, Ruiz's future looks rosy.